What is good, pull gang gang gang? Yes, we in this motherfucker. What is good, boys? Yes, Evolving Wisdom is here for that quick dark energy read. Y'all go ahead and hit that like, subscribe, leave some comments, okay? If you guys would like to get in tomorrow, I will be going live for quick mini spread readings for $25. Okay, if you know you've been need, wanting a reading from me, this is your time, your chance. It will be a quick read here. Just seeing what's going on around you here. You will be able to pay through PayPal or Cash App, okay? Um, if you guys pay early, because some of you guys already did, please show up, okay? Because it, it is what it is. I'm not supposed to go back. I'm not supposed to do one live reading just for you on another day. So please show up if you pay, if you decide to pay early, okay? Um, also, you guys, this Wisdom School of Conjuration, okay, if you guys want to get in on the level one reload, okay, or the level one part two, you guys, please send me the information that is on the website. It's just a brief description of what you need to send me to in order for you to be chosen, okay? Um, we're going to jump into y'all read here, Bull Gang, because it's supposed to be a quick read, okay? I hope everyone is going to be enjoying their weekend, Okay, because I know Sister Girl is, all right? So we're going to jump into your energy and see what the fuck is going on. Wisdom School of Conjuration must be chosen. Join me for a reload of Level 1 Protection Fire Spirit Conjure Course. Friday, October 15th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Must be chosen. Part 2 of Level 1 Conjuring Fire through the arts of writing and petition the correct way. Saturday, October 16th at 7 p.m. Easter Standard Time. Must be chosen. There are limited spots available. Check out what my students are saying about Wisdom School of Conjuration. Boys. Life is changing here, and this is not supposed to be a channeling energy. I need to get my cards out, y'all. It's Friday, and I'm not trying to be up here for five, 40, I said five minutes, 45 minutes or 50 minutes to an hour doing reads here, y'all, because I know I get to channeling just live without the cards. It's going to take a while. There's a major shift going on with you guys, boys. Some of you guys... Maybe, you know, trying to fight this, but I, I feel like some of you guys have just released and let it go. Just like, spirit, just take me. Like, not in that way, like, not death, but just like, I'm going to allow you to handle this here. Faith without no works, though, y'all already know is dead, okay? Just, that's common sense. You don't need a book to tell you that here. No work, you put no work into it, you get nothing here. You can't just sit around and wait for some entity or spirit, whatever, to bring you what you want and there's no actions put forth here some of you guys need to put a lot of action forth um and you have been when it when it comes to what you're trying to get here but regardless of if you were if you wanted this this, this change to come in whatever this energy is it was going to happen one way or another but i just feel like my bulls are just releasing and letting it go and like letting the worry go and just letting it flow in spirit is also leading you to certain people some of you guys is me to help you out and um, push things through for you here. Take heed to what you need um, to do here. Some of you guys, um, you know, getting spiritual counseling and needing to know, is there something, a spell, or is these things you can do here to help me push this energy along here and gas? Evolve from wisdom always. No, okay? I got a book of spells, okay? All right, uh, let's get in here. For all my level one, um, People who came last Saturday, my students and everything, a lot of you guys been emailing me here, a few of you guys. You guys don't have to put in, uh, give me any details or anything here. You just send me an email saying, hey, I'm about to join. I'm about to sign up here. Y'all already know y'all got front row seats at that motherfucker, okay? All right, so... You guys, leave your girl a tip. Any amount is appreciated, bull gang. I really appreciate the love and support you guys give here, okay? Even if you guys just have to leave a comment and say what's up, whatever. Just show some type of support, boys. That's what I'm about. I'm about some level of support, whether you're just saying, hey, evolve wisdom, 
girl, you know, you doing a, a damn good job. That is good enough for me here, okay? Just do your damn thing here, all right? But there's finances flowing through here. Also, there's some type of marriage or soul tie here you guys are dealing with here or just some type of some of y'all is a co-worker y'all deal with here okay i don't want these cards here boys okay nobody ain't trying to get into that we all can agree that in this day and age spiritual protection is a must for you and your loved ones my custom made spell in a bottle necklaces can provide that energy for you whether it's protection against spiritual attacks financial blockages, or protecting your relationships. For more information on my spell in the bottle necklaces, please visit EvolvingWisdom5.com. Okay. Some of you guys, there is a masculine energy or feminine energy. Some of you guys need to watch out for your brother. If you guys have a brother energy around you here, like you're close to your brother or going into business with your brother or someone you consider your brother here, masculine energies here or female, whatever, be careful because this is a motherfucker a little snaky. Okay, there's a little snaky, very calming here, a very calculated type of energy around you here. A lot of interference is coming around. Some of you guys may have some business endeavors or just some things you want, you're trying to put together here, a project, or just get things. Um, some of y'all are trying to keep quiet about it, which is a very good idea because you do got enemies around you here. A lot of masculine energies here, okay? Some of you guys may be over the road or drive over the road or tra traveling here pretty soon in the month of October here. Just be careful. You do got a lot of be cautious energy energy with friendships around you here okay uh or befriending especially masculine energies here also too for my more my masculine energies or feminine energies who's more in their masculine energy you guys have a friend or somebody who wants to befriend you here but they really want to sleep with you here it's the same sex energy i'm picking up here they don't want to be your friend they want to they 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 want to kiss that neck they want to they want to rub on that booty okay they don't want the friendship they want the booty Okay, so I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys are going to pick up on that energy here and I, I would not sleep around with this person here. This person is very, very uh, all over the place and very controlling and manipulative also too here. You guys have your ancestors out here trying to uh, masculine energy, which I picked up yesterday here. There was a strong masculine energy coming in, but there is a masculine energy here that's coming out. Um, some of you guys separated from somebody here, like left they ass in a dust. I was just, for whoever my boys here who recently left somebody alone here, kicked they asses about the motherfucking door out of your pad here, okay, out of your home here. They are going to be causing some disruption around you here they're very pissed very bitchy type of um, person here you know don't know how to move on and it's not even about that they are trying to get back with you or trying to do right by you here they just want to fuck up your shit here they want to make shit not go right with you here and then they're also spreading some rumors with the with amongst the family some of you guys may have been with this person for five plus years or just five years i'm seeing here you also need to be alone here from i'm, I'm here for a while here five months to five years see i hope it's not five years god damn some of you guys may need to recharge your whole self from dealing with some something very low vibrational for so long here but they're spreading rumors here with your family making it seem like it was all your fault it was all your issues here you just you just can't be happy you just can't be happy you can't just let me cheat and uh not take care of no bills or nothing around the house or whatever you just you just not happy they're just spreading a lot of energy negative energy um trying to change the perception of you here of what other people um, think of you here but what's coming towards you is a lot of success in business here a lot of endings from just not having enough or not having what you need here there's finances flowing through here especially uh, coming into October here the beginning of October there's lots of blessings coming in towards you here if you guys are just met someone here some of y'all need to leave the past alone, bulls. Some of y'all need to leave the past alone. I don't know what the hell you circling around for here. Like, just remember, 
Why did you leave that person the first time? Everything ain't meant to go back with. Just because it comes back to you doesn't mean that it's yours. Some motherfuckers just don't get the fucking hint when you tell them, I don't want your dusty ass no more. Okay? So if it comes back to you, that saying is not always, that's not true at all. Okay? Sometimes motherfuckers just come back because they don't want to let go of the good good. Okay? However, boys, okay, some of y'all need to quit living in a damn past here, okay? Quit bringing the devil around you. Nobody no, nobody hasn't changed. Whoever y'all trying to take y'all asses back around, family, mom, cousin, poop, whatever it is, going back to a job, relationship, is it, it, still the same, okay? You need to stand up in your power. There is a lot of little dark energy still. Some of you guys are leaving up out of here or may still feel a little energies around you here okay some of you guys need to get this business going here some of you guys want to start a business here okay in your neighborhood or just online whatever it is you need to get that going here that's just a message real quick here but the queen of swords energy here i also feel like this is you guys here like not playing around with the bullshit anymore here or not settling and i feel like this is more amongst you like this is like i'm standing in my power fuck you and fuck you and fuck your dog too okay that's the energy i'm picking up here but it's like you're grounding yourself here and really standing because this queen of swords is also can be a vicious woman here but she also can be a motherfucker who you gonna play with Okay, she can be that dark feminine here. We'll put you in your place here and still be in her feminine energy here. Okay, because feminine does not mean that you go sit in the corner and don't say shit. Actually, dark feminine, especially melanated feminine of women here, we're going to put your ass in your fucking place and still be all goodness. Okay, so... You, you, you guys, you got a lot of sun energy here, a lot of stars. Some of you guys may be coming into just your energy. And I feel like it's not always having to have get praises outside of yourself to understand that you are a star. I feel like this is the, the energy you guys are possessing. Like, I'm a motherfucking star, okay? Okay, I'm a motherfucking star. I can do this here. Rebirthing here. Look at this. Magician energy here. A lot of celebrations are to be had here. Some of you guys are supposed to be drinking you some wine. Okay, some Fridays, you guys. Don't tell them. I like to drink me some wine and eat me some dark chocolate. Okay? I do. I do. Okay, but you guys made it's a lot of celebrations. You guys, some of you guys are finding out your power. Okay, shout out to all my my students here that joined me last saturday y'all some powerful ass sisters here okay yeah i got y'all shit together some of y'all stepping in your power here because i picked this up for my students here hey booze okay <laughs> but you guys you guys got a lot of beautiful energy a lot of rebirthing a lot of fruitful energy here okay remember it's yesterday i told you guys here that a lot of news or just a lot of information here some of this is from information from this the actual people themselves but i actually feel like spirit is like letting you know like look it ain't nothing to worry about we got this yeah y'all think this ain't being taken care of this wasn't being taken care of this is not going on this did not happen the way you did it did this job didn't come through for you but just hold on here we got something for you here why because you don't give up you keep you kept pressing through all that dark energy you kept pressing through here. We got something for you here. We just wanted to see this here. We wanted to know sometimes, you guys, it's not always about dark spiritual attacks and everything. Sometimes you just go through life here, especially with these planets going on here. And sometimes a lot of it from the outside, the more upper celestial activities going on also too here trying to bring in that low vibrational energy here a lot of you guys are rising to the motherfucking occasions here okay planning your next step here some of you guys are going to be working with people here i do i don't know what this is but i see a group of sisters here working together or coming together here on a spiritual level here and it is good it is great you guys um it's feminine energy coming together here bringing in that more powerful energy here get your shit get your life here okay but i do see that these are some three powerful sisters coming in here and it may be actually i know sometimes people be like you know um now we're not sisters by blood but sometimes it is that okay sometimes you guys just travel from lifetimes and lifetimes together here and it, it, it does sometimes you meet people and you feel like damn this is i know i've known this person before 
Okay, I've known this person before here, and you have. They are a part of your bloodline, or they are a part of your journey here through lifetimes, through lifetimes, and now you are evolved enough to meet this person again, this lifetime here, okay? Because sometimes some friendships are so, so powerful, so magical, and so high uh, evolved here, you can't just meet them at any time in your life here, because maybe you won't respect it, or you won't honor it, or maybe, you know, whatever the case is, but I feel like that is coming through here, and I do feel like some of my feminine energy do do want that here okay uh, I'm also picking up Leo energy also coming in fire energy look at this your cup runneth over with not just finances and blessings here but with wisdom here some of you guys are trying to move or relocate or just do something totally different and I'm going to tell you these guys it takes some time here for those doors open that's why you have magic okay so you can push those motherfucking doors open here okay you can manipulate the elements of the universe and dig into just what you call alchemy here and you can get what you want out of it here without harming um anyone so sometimes you guys have to reach out for re more resources on that level here if you are trying to do something some of you guys trying to get back into school or get 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 shit going for yourself okay sometimes those doors have to be open here but there's a lot of sun energy coming around you guys here you guys bulls whatever energy y'all in y'all very powerful like y'all ain't just y'all not taking on nonsense shit like well you just not you just not for the bullshit anymore here a strong powerful energy coming in with my motherfucking bull gang y'all hit that like and please leave your girl a tip you guys any amount is appreciated i hope i see you guys this saturday tomorrow at 5 p.m eastern standard time for those quick spread reads here Okay, let's get a message here. Oh, that card popped right on out here. Great mystery. What was I saying here? Trust. And I picked that up yesterday when I was channeling in the beginning. Trust. There's great mystery here. There's nothing for you to fear, you guys. And I do understand that there is a certain level of situations bulls can get themselves into or have to change up out of here. They can be very scary. They can be very... um like oh my gosh like is something going on and it's like no it's just life is happening here there's something bigger for you or something that manifests let those things fall away if you have done everything you can to try to keep a certain situation like let's give an example here if it's your job here if you didn't be coming in early here minding your own business doing your tasks and going beyond and be um above and beyond for your you know to keep your your stability and everything but for some reason you keep getting the fucking shit you get the bullshit you get the tail the the um the bad end of the stick here and you end up losing a job or whatever it's uh, you guys sometimes energies come in the and spirit comes in and say because there's something better and if you would have kept in that job you would have stayed there you would have actually been working in your path here or working to inspire people here or to inspire your soul to evolve more here if you would have stayed at that dead end job just because it pays decent Okay, sometimes things have to happen here, but you guys got this here. Also picking up the upper world energy, your future here. There's great mystery going on. Some things are hidden, which I think, I feel like a lot of these things will be um, presented to you guys or shown to you guys. A lot of just, I feel like more of a calm energy, like stop worrying Stop, stop doing, you got, we got you, we got you here. There's a lot of new energy for the future coming in towards you here, okay? A lot of alignment here, okay? Old energy here. Let's get another card here from, um, where we at with the time? Okay, let's see. What do my bulls need to know here? I keep hearing Leo, Leo, Leo. Some of you guys may be Leo or have someone close to you that's a Leo here or maybe speaking to a Leo. Okay, what's going on here? Change is coming here. That's a message for someone who has either strong Leo placements, dealing with the Leo, just Leo. That's all I can say. I don't know what it's directed to, but change is coming. Okay? Change is coming here. Stay strong here. Okay? Hold on. Hold on. Okay? Elder. Elder energy here. Move beyond ancestral patterns here. Okay? Wisdom speaks to you. Okay, let's get that card here. That's the elder. If I can find this card. Okay. 
The elder is an the elder is an ancestor who comes with a message of healing change. He is an embodied soul, yet he has had journeys that go beyond the physical. Therefore, he represents a reclamation of power. When he appears, it is acknowledgement that you have that capacity to move beyond the limitations that have been placed upon you. Some of you guys, what did I tell you, boys? Sometimes, boys, and we can get very too grounded and be like, oh, this job pays good, or this is okay, or I've been with this person for 10 plus years, <coughs> or five plus years. I don't need them to change. Everything is okay. I'm getting into a little hiccup. So my boss stalks me at, at the um, job, and you know, I don't get off, I don't, I deal with a lot of messy people, but <coughs> it pays the bills. Sometimes spirit has to come in and say, no, no, no. You, 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 it's made, it's meant for you to do something more. And you can't do nothing more here when you're stuck in this same dead end <coughs> situation. <coughs> oh, I don't even got my water. Okay. <coughs> if you had, if you have had expectations of success, failure, sadness, or even sickness placed upon you by your family, it is important to know that you are here to create your own story. This card represents personal healing that will bring healing to your family lineage. Okay? Past, present, and the motherfucking future. Know that you <clears throat> know that you get to decide what you take on. And also know that your ancestors are rooting for you and you you and are sorry for any setbacks. They have created for you. What? Let's read that one more time. Let me read that. That's, that's everything I was saying. What? They say what? And also know that your ancestors are rooting for you and are sorry for any setbacks that they have created for your monkey ass. Okay? Or for your ass. Okay? Because sometimes... You don't get bulls, especially you don't change shit until the fire put up under your ass. And don't act like y'all don't know. Bulls, you know, sometimes you gotta, you, some things have to just fall apart before you be like, oh, shit, I was supposed to be moving. Oh, I was supposed to be getting another job. I seen this coming. Sometimes you just, y'all need to trust your intuition. You doubt it too much. And so answers just have to come in and say, no, 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 we got something bigger for you. And you, you're not doing it. And we keep talking to you. We all in your dream. We, we said we put a big ass sign up. Every time you come out the house, it's a big, it's an airplane flying in the sky with a, a helicopter flying in the sky with the words on the back of it. But you still be like, they ain't talking to me. They ain't, they ain't talking to me. Okay. Sometimes it has to happen that way here. Sometimes answers just let you know when, there's energies around you, spirit, giving you spiritual attacks here. And you need to amplify your protection. Okay? All right, you guys. That is, you guys, Friday read here. Quick read here. Okay? <laughs> However, you guys, please like, support the channel, leave some comments. I will try to get through the comments when I have the motherfucking time to. I will see a lot of you guys tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you have any questions or concerns, you guys, you can always email me. I try to get back to you as soon as possible. Usually, I'm usually up on my email unless I'm dealing with my family or just don't feel like being bothered with because I'm tired and I'm only one energy. So, you guys be very respectful of that and that time because I do have many, many, many clients and a lot of responsibilities also too. So, you guys, until next time, this is Evolving Wisdom. And yes, y'all see that head? Yes.